you're up next to tell me what you think about Microsoft. Hey, you know, I like secretly love Microsoft mostly because I, I, I picked this out of, it's like a nostalgia play. I think people are feeling, you know, they're feeling a lot of anxiety, anxiety now. And, you know, Microsoft kind of represents like an old fashioned kind of warm blanket. And, and look, Google, Facebook, Twitter, they're going to, they're going to get so much shit in the next decade that Microsoft is just going to sit back, relax, make all the money. Uh, no one's going to come after them. They already had their antitrust problems. And every list I see, I mentioned this just capital list. They are number one on that list. Uh, there's another list, that, um, number one for employee happiness. They're, they just There's just something going on there. I got a buddy who works there who has a very good life, gets paid very well, very happy. They just, again... I know it's Microsoft. I know that you know they're, they're probably inherently evil. I just wanted to pick one big data company, and I just feel good about this one. I think this can make us some money. I like Microsoft. That's it. Emma, <laughs> look. Every here's the problem with this. Yeah, is that I have to argue for mine, but then when I have to argue against yours, I would am just using arguments that could rip all of my pictures. Well, it's fine. Track. You're allowed to, though. I mean, I'm that's okay with. The, that's actually the backbone of investing. Yeah, I mean, I'm o, I, I'm okay yeah. with your idiocy rejecting Microsoft. It's fine. I mean, I know. First of all, CEO, person of color. I know that bothers you. Uh, I get it. <laughs> I, like, I understand. <laughs> Didn't we start off this by saying that, like, I was the token, like, zillennial communist of this enterprise? Zillennial. I haven't I heard that. For? I like that. Zillennial. That's what Matt always calls it. I'm Gen okay. Z. All right. Uh, what are you Microsoft? Are you going to reject Microsoft? Um, no. I'll say yes to Microsoft. Wow. Right. And yeah. both of you bought Salesforce because you thought they were the acquisition of Slack meant they could compete with Microsoft, and then you're buying the competitor. They can uh, both do well. With Here's my reason for Microsoft. I yeah. think that people will listen to anything that Bill Gates says. If it comes out of Bill Gates' mouth, people believe it. And that's all you need, really. He doesn't will, work there yeah. anymore, right? He, well, it doesn't people, matter. people still associate him with the company. I, I will say this about Microsoft. And again, I don't know if we're getting like fooled, getting corporate eyewashed here, but half of the stories that come out of Microsoft is like these stories of them trying to do right by the world. And I don't know if that's the Bill Gates effect, but they're, they, they, for a corporate entity, they are they are constantly like trying, like they they try more than anybody. I also think that Bill Gates has pulled off the PR move of the century. People used to hate Bill yeah. Gates, and now all of a sudden it's the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, and look at all the good we're doing for the world. When twenty years ago, people were like, Bill Gates well, is the actual devil incarnate. Well, Emma, you're speaking to my initial point is that he's not Mark Zuckerberg, and people appreciate that about him. I know, yeah, which is well, a low bar and a sad bar, but you're right. We it's like you love him in contrast to the heinousness of other companies today. Yeah, that's, that's it. That's how I'm investing. I wanted I didn't want to just pick a bunch of like patchouli weed like solar panels, which is what I am inclined to do. So I wanted to take a risk here. What do you think? Mark all right. Well I think well, first of all, I think you're I think you're right. I, it does make me nervous that <laughs> that every Woke data provider has Microsoft as one of the wokest companies in the yeah, world. Yeah, I, I agree with you. You I gotta do. I am, have I'm concerned about that too. Th there's, there's, there seems to be broad consensus that Microsoft is doing everything the wokiest, and yeah. that is like that to me is um of an eventual kick to the groin coming. So uh, it makes me a little bit nervous. I think, but, he, I think, I think he's calling you out, MSCI. But but we're buying it right now. We're right. buying it. 